Good evening. A string of armed robberies prompted a high speed chase through the heights, but without the help of two teenagers. Police may not have found this accused thief as fast as they did. News 13's Brady Wakayama is here with the details. Brady. Brittany, the suspect made a critical error that ended up leading police right to him after he was accused of committing armed robbery three times. Albuquerque police say it started at the Big Five Sporting Goods store near San Mateo and Manal. Police say 19-year-old Lawrence Lopez Jr. walked into the store around 6 p.m. yesterday evening and walked up to the cash register. An employee told police Lopez pulled out a black handgun and pointed it at her and told her, quote, hand me all the money in the register, and she complied. Police say Lopez then left the store and ran into two teenagers whom he allegedly pulled a gun on also, demanding they hand over their cell phones before running off. What Lopez likely did not know is that the teens had Find My iPhone set up on their phones. Officers say they could see the phones were at the Walmart on Carlisle and Manal. Undercover officers spotted Lopez in the distinct Cobalt blue truck he was driving. When officers tried to pull him over, Lopez took off speeding down I-40 before surrendering in the Heights neighborhood near Candelaria in Louisiana. We saw a two-door Cobalt blue truck speed by about 50 miles an hour. We heard, saw two cop cars screeching coming to a halt. They cornered him and then we have 16 cop cars. The assailant got out of his truck with his hands up and surrendered. Police say Lopez only got away with $272 from Big Five, but they did find $400 on him at the time of his arrest. And Lopez had no violent criminal history prior to his arrest yesterday. Brittany, back to you. Okay, Brady, Lopez is facing several felony charges, including three counts of armed robbery and aggravated fleeing.